just a beautiful day outside. The grass is green. UBC is blooming. Couldn't ask for a better day. It's actually not raining for once. So today we're skating UBC, a few ledge spots. There's some more behind me. This is the first spot we're gonna go to. Uh, shout out Adriano for kickstarting the inspiration to get some mic'd up commentary going while skating. This is the first time I've ever done this, so it's a little bit of an experiment. I'm using an iPhone 6S Plus because it's the only phone that actually offers auxiliary ports nowadays. This is my chill iPhone 7, but this is the model that they stopped using the auxiliary port. This one actually has an auxiliary port, so I will be using this phone. However, it is much larger in my pocket, so it might be really annoying because it is hard to skate with a large phone in your pocket. Fun fact, I found this in my building in the garbage pile where all the desks and old furniture go in the basement. I was walking past to unlock my bike and I saw this mic just chilling on the desk. And so I grabbed it and sure enough, it works, which is amazing. I'm excited to try it out. So let's get some fun tricks and then move to another spot that is more fun. Let's get it. Let's see how this goes. Okay, no sympathy on this ledge. Let's get it. All right. Let's continue. Nose grind. I'm taking time out of my day to wax this. I think that is like a skateboarder's pet peeve is wanting to skate so much and not wanting to wax the ledge or anything because you just want to skate the damn thing that you should be waxing. There it is. Good catch. Good game. That was a little bit suspect. There it is. Well, that was fun. I'm not going to skate this anymore. I'm going to go literally a block away to a taller ledge. You've seen it in my videos in the past, but I really like it. So it's a little more challenging and enjoyable to skate. And it doesn't have a pole right behind it, which is insane. Like this thing needs to get removed for skateboarding because that thing has almost taken people out a handful of times. Arms straight, feet straight, ground test, and oh, that was a little sketchy, hold on. Arms straight. Oh, there it goes, you see that? Oh yeah, see that? Yeah, you saw that. You're probably wondering why I'm wearing this hat, but it's actually just because I think it suits my fit well today, and all my other hats, I don't really like the way they fit, so. Right over there, there's some more ledges. And I'm also gonna go to a spot right over there with more ledges, which is crazy to think. These ledges are really nice, they're waxed up, they are real concrete, and there is no cap on them. And they're in a lot of areas. Except for it does get repetitive because you don't see new ones. Here we go. All right, so this is the next spot right by this building. It's a pretty cool building, I must say. It's really nice. A lot of light is bouncing on it. Let's get this thing going nicely so we can just show it love instead of aggravation. We want this ledge to be our friend and not our enemy. That was a little weird looking. That thing is crusty. Ay, yikes. That was a little ugly. <clears throat> For to measure this ledge, it is almost a little bit over half the size of a skateboard. That's all. That was fakey. That's not ex 
exactly what I'm looking for, but we can add on to that. I don't know, man. You be the judge. The sledge is kind of a pain in the ass, so I don't feel like doing it again, wasting a lot of energy. Oh, that sounded awful. Somebody literally drove into a a concrete square in the ground with the UBC building vehicle. That's a bit, that's a lot to take in. Let's do it for him. He might get fired from his job. We don't know. Let's hope for the best. Let's try to get another one for him. Look at that. That's for the broken UBC building vehicle. Wow, that is sick. Back it up. Okay, I think we're money on that. We're money on this ledge. We're gonna go to a different spot. This thing right here is literally what that driver ran into. He pulled straight into it, went under the fender and just made a huge noise. We can see evidence right here. There is a piece of plastic that broke off the bottom and some more here. What a fool. Hope you get to keep your job, pal. I'm gonna go to the next spot because I could care less. But it was a cool little event. Here's a hat, if anyone wants a new hat. So here I am, relaxing a ledge again. But this time, seems a little bit more heaty. There's people working indoors, so I don't know how long this will fare. We'll just have to make noise and see what we can do. Either I'm really loud and it bothers them and then get kicked out, or because it's so chill at UBC and every, there's spots everywhere that people just accept the fact that skateboarding is chill, even though it makes a lot of noise. Let's try to get a cleaner Tesla G7. That was a bit much, don't you think? Oh yeah, I could definitely do it to like regular, but I don't want to do that. Uh oh. Shoelace is getting a little undone here. Do some TLC on the shoelace. Now we're back. Yeah, I don't know if that counts. How much you want to bet I have right here? Yep. I'm good with that. For the fakie. Bye. Aye, that was not it. That was okay. I swear it's just too short or something. Because I'm not being able to get it. Holy shit. Right here. Man, I am so over this. What the hell, dude? Dude, it literally, every time I try this trick, it catches here because I'm grinding it for too long. I don't want to wax this part though because it doesn't even look like it's been waxed. Just plain not the play. I don't know, man. Okay, so I've done two of those tricks on here. It took so long in my opinion. We're at a skate park or something with 
coping on it would be way more easy to do it but because it's so rough I have to really make sure I'm in it before I do the shove uh, so I'm gonna go to the next spot because this is just I'm over it I did all the tricks that I actually feel are necessary and fun to do on this I'm out oh yeah some good coffee after a good session said nobody really because nobody wants to drink coffee after a long skate session but I have water I'm just not drinking it because I got to get my money's worth and finish this coffee which I'll do right now okay we can go to the next spot I'll drink some water over there put the wax away and let's get back to work this spot again You've probably seen it in a more popular video I've done, which was the Adidas review. I just genuinely like it because you have to pop your tricks out of this thing. I would prefer to do today a front side, board side pop out and a lip slide pop out to fakie or regular, whatever. Go for the board. So first try was exciting, didn't expect to do that as quickly. No dice, no dice, I don't play dice, I actually don't know how to play dice though. There's the left slide, yeah! little no comply to finish the line off. Let's try it out, eh? All right, this is the last spot of the day. I am not going to skate at UBC any, any longer. Might be granite, but it's not very smooth. Fuck, this ledge is so sticky regardless of its of the love I'm giving it. Alright, I'm calling it. Peace. I actually have to get my camera back, so I'm coming to get it. Well, everyone, thanks for tuning into this video. I appreciate your support through the months that I have not uploaded. I will do my best to keep uploading. Hopefully you enjoyed this commentary. I'm going to sign off now. Ciao.